hey there hope you're doing good when people have a problem they come up with a solution so let's take an example a problem might be that engineers are not delivering fast enough solution might be a non technical stakeholder might ask the engineers please deliver it quickly or explain the need you know our competitors have so many features we don't or you know we have only 6 months and where we need to move fast to kind of whatever right so when there's a problem people try to come up with a solution but this often doesn't work it doesn't work because engineers are not deliberately making it slower so simply telling them make it faster is going to be like a meaningless thing to say it's like saying we should take care of the environment everyone will not but nothing will change it's almost like a platitude so what should we do instead from the problem we need to go down to the root cause in this case the root cause might be i mean there could be many root causes it could be on the technical side it could be on the non technical side i'll just give a random example let's say technically there's a lot of technical debt in the system it hasn't been architected well that is why things are slow let's assume that we need to identify this root cause so in this example what the non technical stakeholder should do is ask the engineer like set aside a separate meeting not in the context of something else where you know this issue won't have much focus separate meeting to kind of brainstorm without blame why is this happening and if the engineer says it's happening because of technical debt and bad architecture then you will be able to find a solution a problem can have multiple root causes as well the first root cause can be kind of technical debt second root cause might be let's say we don't have competent engineers in the company a two a third root cause might be the non technical stakeholders giving a task to engineers and before it is done the same person giving a second task and before it is done somebody else giving a third task and so on naturally nothing will get done so these could be the three root causes of this particular problem in this hypothetical example bad architecture um second tier engineers and non technical stakeholders always interrupting and changing the task to be worked out so now that you have identified these three root causes you can come up with solutions so don't go straight from problem to solution sometimes it doesn't work come down to the level of root causes identify them then work on them and all this requires patience sometimes i see people being impatient just do it somehow by monday that's not going to work patience gives you the time and space to understand the root causes and introspect If you'd like me to help you solving your problems my consulting link is in the description